Washington is kicking off first, and we're ready to get this game underway. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. That brings up second and nine. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 26. Mike 10, Mike 10. Ready! And he tackles him hard at the 22. As an offensive line, you've got to do a better job as a group at communicating. The defense brought pressure, and that time they did not do a good job of picking up the linebackers. The linebacker was able to come up with a sack. Excellent series by this defense, forcing them to go three and out. And the offense really struggled on this drive. They're going to have to pick it up if they want to move the ball on these guys. It's away, and it's a booming punt. Gets to about the 41-yard line. Washington's coaching staff so confident they know they've got a guy that's one of the best running backs in the country and that they can just play their game and not worry about the fact they're on the road. Well, Brett, his big playability not only can give you big chunks of yards on the road, but more importantly, it can quiet this atmosphere and allow the quarterback in this offense just getting back and just being able to run and be able to communicate. And I think that's a big challenge for this team. So look for his big playability to maybe even out the atmosphere and give this offense a chance to be able to execute. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. Excellent pass defense. You've got to be able to make a lightning quick reaction to bat the ball away like he did right there. From their own 47-yard line, it's third down. Caught, and he's hit immediately. They couldn't get the first down. Well, here they were hoping to get a few extra yards after the catch. Give the defense credit. They held him short. He makes it to the 48-yard line. Now, the defense knew exactly what was coming, and they still got out muscles. They'll have to stay out on the field for another set of downs. around the 48-yard line. That makes it second and 14. From their own 48-yard line, it's second down. Down! On the delay. Brought down at about the 49. Quick out to his receiver. It's a fumble. It's recovered. Wow, the receiver had a big play on his mind, and he forgot about securing the football. I'm sure he'll hear all about that in practice from his coaches and teammates. This group of receivers is a competitive bunch, and they don't let each other get away with mistakes like that. Lucky for him, the offense recovered at that time. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. Watch 23, watch 23. Easy, easy, easy. Gives it left side. Fumble! Recovered by the defense. And he's taken down at the 24-yard line. They work hard and they got the turnover. Uh, this is what it's all about. Defense taking advantage of an opportunity. They're pouncing on the loose ball. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Ready? Blue 45. 
Catches it, and he's immediately tackled behind the line. Screen pass incomplete. Third down and 11 coming up here. Ball on the 25-yard line. He might not be able to get the pass off. That's a great tackle at the 32. That makes it fourth and nine. Fourth and long here after the sack. Washington is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and he nails the long field goal. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Washington's looking awfully impressive right now in defense, but we are in the first quarter. Yeah, this is about a dominant first quarter that we have seen in a long time. But let's see if they can continue to play this well throughout the rest of the ball game. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Well, the defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack. Somehow, he's able to throw the ball away. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. Throws a bullet. Got it. Complete. He's out of bounds. They make the stop at about the 41. Call it a gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. It's second and eight. Ball on the 41 yard line. Mike 10, Mike 10. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. That's a loss of four yards. That brings up third and 12. Let's go! Black and five! And he almost has the INT. Yeah, the quarterback's breathing a huge sigh of relief because he got away with throwing what should have been an interception. Oh, excellent punt. He's taken down at the 18-yard line. Let's get some points going right now. Not a lot of offense here in the opening court. I'm with you. I'd like to see a lot more offense than we've seen up to this point. Give credit to the defenses, but I think you're going to see both these offense coordinators get more of a feel for things and start to adjust their play call. Just about ready to call the first play of this drive. They were able to pick up a field goal on their last possession. He's tackled at the 31. The fullback is a safety valve for the quarterback most times. So it's pretty reassuring to know you've got a safety valve as talented as this guy. Washington has a three-point lead. Alert, Blue 14! Blue 14! Tackle made at the 39. Number 44 on the tackle at the 39-yard line. That makes it second and two. They bring him down in the backfield. Over the middle, got his tight end. And
and he hits him hard at the 49-yard line. Number five brings him down at the 49-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Set! Okay! He's at the 40. First down. An exciting first quarter comes to an end. 3-0, Washington. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. They'll bring him down at the 29-yard line. Makes it out to about the 10. That makes it first and goal. Washington is up a field goal. Quick strike to the receiver, touchdown. He makes the PAT. A 10-play, 81-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game, but the offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead. Hand off, and he's met immediately. And the defensive end comes up with a big play. Boy, he's quick as a cat, no question. He got tremendous penetration and was able to wrap him up for a loss there. From their own 22-yard line, second down. He's out of bounds at the 25. Three yards there on the play. Not much of a gain for the wide receiver, but at least he made the catch and got himself some positive yards. 20, 59 Philly, 59 Philly. Three, three, three. And he's tackled at the 20-yard line. So the defense does their job well on that series. That brings up fourth and 15. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. They were lucky to prevent a big return there. Yep, that could have been big if he could have gotten a few more blocks and was able to find the seam. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Down he goes at the 42-yard line. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. Great play by the senior linebacker to step up in traffic and make that tackle. Just throws this one away. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Doesn't get there. Well, the defense stood tall there. Well, the defense did what they had to do to get three and out and now get the offense back on the field.
He puts it away, and it's a great kick. They'll bring him down at the 17-yard line. So we're just about ready to return to action. Pressured and run down. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Looking to dig themselves out of a little hole here after the sack. It's second and 14. Mike 10, Mike 10, Mike 10. He goes out of bounds at the 15 yard line. He really got a hold of that one. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. Washington staff right now, I would think, going into halftime, Kirk's got to be happy. I mean, here's their guy not having the kind of game he's used to having. But if they can get in the lead, I think they'd go right back to him. And to think that this team at this point has the lead, and, and considering the way their superstar has played, they've got to feel pretty good heading into halftime, knowing that it's a matter of time until their, their bell cow starts to really start to hit on all cylinders. And I wouldn't be shocked at all. You know, even though they have the lead, and he hasn't played well, you go into the second half, you still got to try to get him his touches and his carries and hope that eventually he catches fire. And who knows what this offense is really capable of doing today. Down! So it's second and ten. Ball on the 49-yard line. And he's got his receiver. It's the sophomore. Any offense is predicated on being able to move efficiently like this. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. The defense was ready for that pass and catch, and they did a good job to hold them for such a short game. Try to change the field position with his kick. fun to be part of a defensive battle and that's certainly what we have right now yeah give credit to both of these defenses i mean they, they're playing with a lot of energy and i think they're doing a nice job up front at the line of scrimmage at this point they're not giving this either of these offenses a chance to make a play well the guys are chomping at the bit down there waiting for the game to start back up makes the catch and he's got nowhere to go From their own 17 yard line. Second down. Here we go. I got eight. I got eight. Ready. Flat 68. Flat 68. Hut hut. Hut hut. Quick strike to the receiver. He's taken down at the 25-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. We're halfway through, and it's been a good one. 10-0, Washington.
Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. The Huskies have the lead at the half and they have all the momentum in the world on their side. Everything has gone their direction. But David, you've played a lot of ball. Have you ever been in a situation where you had everything going your way and halftime comes, and for some reason it all changed in the second half. Well, unfortunately, yes, Reese. <laughs> You've been in a situation where it seems like nothing you could do was wrong. Every, you had the answer to every question that was asked. And then in the second half, it seems like the coaches start asking different questions on the other side of the field, and you might not be as ready for it. So you got to make sure that you take the momentum and make sure that you take advantage of it because things change quickly, and if you get on the wrong side of it, sometimes you just can't stop it. That's going to do it at halftime, just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, bro. I'm going to get something in the cafeteria. I'm hungry. Wait, 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 don't leave until you get my order. Brad Kirk, take the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here, just about set for the second half. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Look at a scramble out. He can't get away from the pressure. That'll make it second and nine. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. Down! Caught open field. Caught down at about the 29 yard line. Call it a gain of 10 yards. Third down. Looks for his tight end over the middle. Tackle at the 41. Number 22 makes the tackle at the 41 yard line. First down. He's at midfield. Makes it out to about the 50. Looking for the corner. And he's taken down at the 27-yard line. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Second and 14. Ball on the 31 yard line. Pressure coming. And they make the stop around the 23 yard line. Hit immediately. That's a game of 11 on the play. That makes it first and 10. He makes it to the nine. Completes it, and he's hit hard immediately. That's a game of three. That'll bring up third and four. Tries to get around the corner. He's tackled at the four-yard line. So they're going to go for it here. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Six, 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 
Touchdown, Huskies! Strong run by the halfback to get into the end zone. He's a pretty sure bet to get six when you're this close to the end zone. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Washington ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Washington's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. And I think it's going to require that kind of effort to be able to win this game. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. With a quick throw. And he's got it! Tackle made around the 29-yard line. And the wideout gets a chance to show what he can do. Oh, he sure does, and he doesn't disappoint either. Great athletic ability. So after the big pass play, we've got a first down. Gains his way to the 20-yard line. He's scrambling. He's wrapped up for the sack. That'll bring up third and two. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. They go to the ground, and he stops short. He gets it up and it's long enough and it's good. Iowa is ready to kick it away. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The offense will come out again hoping to have similar results as their last drive. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, and he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against his defense. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 23-yard line. Got a man tackled for a loss. Loss of five there. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense might want to consider that next time they try that play. He's under pressure. Setting up blockers. The running back's got it on the screen. They'll bring him down right around the 22-yard line. That'll bring up fourth and 13. Oh, excellent punt. Brought down at the 40. So he got a little on that return. Well, Brad, early it looked like there was an opening there, but the seam closed quickly. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. They hand it off. That's a great tackle at the 36. Where in the world was he going on that run? Well, that's a good question. I thought for a while he got his directions messed up. Fourteen. 
from their own 36 yard line. It's second down. Scrambling around. And he's tackled at about the 41. Picks up five on the scramble. That'll make it 39. That's three down and one to go. The Huskies lead it by two touchdowns. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Four down, four down. Mike 10. Mike 10, Mike 10. Red Hey, Blue 88. <laughs> Halfback's got it on the quick throw. That's a huge, huge stop here in the fourth quarter. They've got the lead. They're going to get the football back, but there's still a lot of ball left. That'll make it fourth and ten. They've got ten guys up. They're coming after the kick. And this one is a beauty. When he made the decision to return the ball, I'm sure he thought there was going to be some room to run. But boy, did it vanish in a hurry. Still, he got something out of it. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Enough for the first down. And down he goes around the 39 yard line. Number five brings him down at the 39 yard line. First down. Set. Oklahoma. Hey, I need one over here. Hot, hot. He gets sacked on the play. Boy, this defense really came to play today. Well, they said before the game that they wanted to put a lot of pressure on this quarterback. They sure stuck to that plan. From their own 35-yard line, second down. Well, did you see how the defense just swarmed to the ball carrier? That was fantastic pursuit. He makes it to the 32-yard line, and he'll be stopped well short of the first down. You have the lead in the fourth quarter, and it's third and long. Why risk a turnover? Just play it safe and work the clock. The punting team's got to give their kicker some time. yard line not great but not bad either as long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position then you're headed in the right direction not much luck the last time this offense had the ball just under three to go in regulation he scrambled he's taken down right around the 44 yard line it out to his receiver in a hurry, and he hits him hard at the 47. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Now he's scrambling. Brought down around the 44-yard line. 
Now he tries to buy some time. Tackle around the 43 yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. That makes it second and 10. Second and 10. Ball on the 43 yard line. Four down, four down. Watch 19, watch 19. Blue 88. Going right to his tailback. 98 weasel! 98 weasel! That makes it third and seven. Might have been some early movement up front. False start. Offense. They'll give this one another try after the flag. And on third down, too. Third down. That's when you don't want those kind of things to happen. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 34. The mic. The mic. Here we go. Most Red 68. Red 68. Going for it all to the end zone. You don't want to ever give your opponent a second chance. But that's exactly what they did by not making that interception. That, that makes, makes it fourth and 12. Tight end right. Just yeah. over a minute in the fourth quarter. Quick pass. Wow, you just got to love it for this defense. They come up with the stop of the ball game and maybe the season. Their last drive broke down and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? Fights forward to about the 39. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. Two times, two times. From their own 39-yard line, it's second down. Iowa is going to have to use their second time out of the half. Fights forward to about the 49. Short gain. That'll move the chains. This defense should know what's coming at this point, but this rushing attack is a tough yeah. one to stop. He takes a knee. 10-19. From their own 47-yard line. Second down. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, number eight's coming. Number eight's Mike. Mike. Set. Oklahoma. Hot, hot. And he carries the ball for a nice game. And this one comes to an end. Our final count in this game, 17-3, Washington. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.